You know what time it is, man. You know what time it is. We, I got my Xbox controller in my hand. Back on this Animal Crossing, bruh. It's 5 p.m. It's getting into the nighttime. It's looking amazing. I do gotta do some more things off camera. But I wanted to show y'all what I was doing, man. I got the pizza. If you was watching my Fortnite video, uh, I got the pizza. It's the same day. I did a lot off camera, but like when you look at it, it's probably gonna be like, oh, that ain't that much. So basically what I did was, you know my original pumpkin patch. I gotta pick the rest of these pumpkins. But I'll do that in a minute. Uh, I went across the way and I'm gonna just of course make this symmetrical. And I made a pumpkin patch right here. You know what I'm saying? So we had double the pumpkins. And this one produces so many orange. And I need orange. Orange is the most important. So we gonna have all kind of pumpkin DIYs, man. And while I'm thinking about it and I'm over here, let me go ahead and buy two paper lanterns because I got to get two paper lanterns to, to make that look as cool as the other side. I want to get two paper lanterns and I want to get the two jack-o'-lanterns. So you want to get those two and then I want to go over here and make... I got four DIYs left to get to. So hopefully today in this video, we'll be able to get all four of them. We doing all that today, man. So let me go ahead and drop my new lanterns. It looks super official. And then I'll get my paper ones. I'll put those in the corner. That's gonna look amazing, man. Actually, you know what? I need to make another one too. There's gonna be so many pumpkins in here, man. They got they're gonna have to upgrade the house storage or something. Cause I can't even imagine this. And then Christmas on top of it. I don't know how they're going to do it, man. Like, because I'm about to go crazy with Halloween. You already see how much I'm doing. Oh, I didn't want to talk to you, June. All right, move out the way. You're in the way. I'm trying to move this over. So I can go ahead and drop me a little jack-o'-lantern right there. Yes, sir. That looks official. I love that. Matter of fact, I could go here and push those in some, couldn't I? That looks kind of good like that. I might, I might do two pumpkins on each side. Now I'm looking at it. Y'all been liking these long videos of me just decorating, man. So I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep bringing y'all those. I mean, you can get a lot of ideas from like your island and stuff. And that's, I need to start marketing my videos like that. Like I'm learning from other YouTubers what they do. I need to start doing like, oh, cool ideas for Halloween. You know what I'm saying? Like that type of stuff. Because it'll get in the search results better. So yeah, like this. Now I could go ahead and do pumpkin patch on both sides, but then it's going to be pointing to the wrong direction. Or will it? I'm imagining this won't be backwards even if you flipping around, right? Yeah, it's gonna point to the same direction no matter what. I hate that. I might need to get a new pattern because then I could put pumpkin patch on both sides. I love the pumpkin patch though, man. I keep taking these screenshots, but the f but fun fact, actually really, really, really sad fact, I don't even know where the screenshots are going and how do I get them off of my switch like no no cap I don't even know what to do with that but I'm taking them so but it would be helpful to know that because I could use those as the thumbnail let me get my dough give me my dough man there's a lot of things I plan on doing in this island man so I hope y'all ready I definitely hope y'all ready because this little part right here is just the beginning. I gotta pick these pumpkins real quick, but I think I wanna redo the whole bottom part of this island. And then we still got all this to do over here with the Able Sisters, which I've been thinking like, maybe I should make the Able Sisters like the pumpkin patch girls. You feel me? Like maybe they do the Able Sisters, but then on the side, they tend to the pumpkin patch. I'm just really trying to get an idea how I want to set this island up 
like location wise. I know we ain't getting another business right now. And even if we do, I do have a space for one. Uh, instead of having four spaces, which was a little optimistic of me last time, thinking that they was going to give us three or four buildings. Uh, but, you know, you got to be optimistic sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Got to be optimistic. But what I plan on doing this episode is getting this situation together with this Able Sisters. And maybe going up there by Nook's Cranny and hooking that up. Now, y'all see how many pumpkins I got. Look at that. That's how you want your inventory to look. Now, with that being said, see that right there? I, just, I need to get that. I think that might be more important than the other ones. I don't know. I got to remember which ones those are. I just want to see what's in the shop because this is a brand new day. Oh, that one look a little different than the other one. How much y'all want for this? Five thou? I'll give you five thou. Watch me get the DIY though. Like right when I go up there and talk to some people. I need to get my piece of candy. I need to go up here and go in these people's houses and try to find a DIY. I gotta shake these fools down, man. Give me the give me the Halloween DIY. I'll break your knees. You already know. Oh, you ain't even building nothing, Peanut. You supposed to be building, yo. You ain't building nothing. I ain't got nothing to talk to you about. I think I'm gonna put a pumpkin out of outside of everybody's house. I was gonna get that tiger too, y'all, that y'all saw in the last episode. But what ended up happening was that he was playing, man. Then he wanted to replace Agnes, and I didn't want to let Agnes go because I like Agnes. It was either Future or Zell. I mean, Fuchsia or Zell. Yeah, what you got for me, Zell? You give me something good, I won't replace you. Are oh, you giving me the spooky arch? That's amazing. Wait a minute, what kind of music he got in here? That's pretty smooth. I like this song. I appreciate that, Zell. What song is this? KK Swing. It sounds like some 50s stuff. I, I need that. I like that. I like that sound. You got a piano and everything, huh? It almost sounds like he playing it. That's crazy how it almost sounds like it's on key with something, though. Alright, he gave me the spooky arch, though. That is a major win for us. And the reason that's, reason that's a major win is because that means we only have three more Halloween DIYs to get. You might be saying that's still a lot. But yesterday, we had none. And I know for y'all, that's probably like eight days ago, but... <laughs> I've been making a lot of videos of this game, man. Because I like it. You know, I really do like this. And this is the first time I've ever really built on here with y'all. And I, and I kind of like that. It reminds me of when I do building episodes on The Sims. Except before, I used to get, like, not hate, but, like, flack from it. But on this game building is this game this game is building so i appreciate that so we get the holiday i mean the spooky arch man we get the spooky arch this is official we need hardwood and clay both things that i have a whole bunch of at the house or at least a decent amount so we're gonna go pick that up Make sure you subscribe and ring that bell. <laughs> I don't even really know where we're going to put these, but you best believe I'm about to craft two of them. I might put them right at the pumpkin patch. That might be dope. Like right at the entrance. That might be a good idea. I didn't know. Like I found out by um, yesterday after I was watching the one dude I was watching, Nintendo. 
you can plant the pumpkins right next to each other. So when I found that out, I was like, yo, bet. I'm about to put all of these next to each other. End up being 64 pumpkin spaces. So each one of my patches holds 64 pumpkins. That's uh, how many? 64 times 64? I mean, 64 plus 64 is 128. Yeah, 128 pumpkins, man. I didn't water these, did I? I need to do that real quick because if I time travel, I need these to be watered with that golden water. We need that golden, <laughs> I was about to say golden shower, bro. See, that's what I'm saying. I can't be, I can't be using my, my humor on here with Animal Crossing because it's just too much. Might have little kids watching, you know what I'm saying? Little kids, little babies. But, uh, yeah, I need to get the golden rain <laughs> on these flowers, a.k.a. pumpkins. So they grow at least two. Because when I didn't water them and it just got rained on, they all grew one pumpkin. Which is still 64 pumpkins. But if you're doing two, that's 128. And then you do that times two. What is that? 250 something? You know what I'm saying? That's a lot of pumpkins, man. Okay, so... Oh, yeah. Let's see what these arches look like. It's starting to get dark. You know, the arch might actually be a little bit too small to go here. But let's see. Ooh, that looks so official, though. That look official, man. That look nice. That actually is perfect there. What if I scooted it up one? Yeah, if I scooted it up one. Bro, that's amazing. Look at that. Oh, that's a big bet. We doing that on both sides. Yeah, that's big bet. Big, 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 big. That's big bet. You know what I'm saying? Big, 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 big. That's going on both sides. That is bigly, bigly. Bam, look at that. That looks phenomenal, man. And then what did I do here? I did the pumpkin patch with a pumpkin, a lantern, then we did a bush. I think I'm gonna go ahead and get that panel and we're gonna do a panel on both sides. I think I'm gonna definitely do that. What did I do on this side? Oh yeah, I put the table on this side. I mean, the table is cool. I, you know what I'm saying? It's not bad. I only have one table right now though, so. Until I get another table. Spooky standing lamp. I put that next to the tree facing that way. So I need to do that over here. <laughs> but see, I don't know if it's enough room on this side. But yeah, it is. I could also put it over here too. And face it the other way. Like that. Oh, it's different on both sides. This side is more evil and like mischievous. This side is sad. Hey, that's dope. I did not know that those were two sided. I think I'm going to put it on this side though, because this is the side it, it is on the other side of the map. Is that too much pumpkin action though? Maybe I should put it right here instead. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. I might change those lanterns to black too. Just to go with the Halloween vibe of black and, and orange. I really wish I could change the color of these to orange, but you know, it is what it is. Beggars can't be choosers. This ain't Chipotle. You know what I mean? So, before I go drop all these pumpkins off. I probably should make some stuff because I got plenty of pumpkins. I mean, I could just go crazy with, with, with pumpkins on this island because they don't require that much to make. This is weeds and pumpkins. Like, you know what I mean? How many weeds I got? Let me check this real quick. Oh, I got 145 weeds, bro, and 146 pumpkins. I got so much I could do. I love these, too. But I do want to skip a couple days because I want to get all the DIYs at least in the next two days. 
for y'all. So, like, in the next episode, I want to at least have all the DIYs that episode. Because what I'm planning on doing is doing this all through October. I got vlogs that's coming out, too. But I want to do this game all through October. And then November is going to be, like... Kind of like October is. And then, of course, Vlogmas is coming out in December. And with Vlogmas, what I plan on doing is actually vlogging every day. And I also want to game every day. Now, whether or not that happens, I don't know. But it would be nice if I could put a vlog out every single day and a gaming video every single day on my main channel. And then on the two separate new channels, they could be uploading every day. Which I know is weird because some people that are subscribed to both, y'all the loyal ones too. I, I hate to keep like going back and forth because those are the loyal people and they like, bro, where you want me to be? You know what I mean? Like you got me over here. You know, maybe I'll take these. You know what I'm thinking about doing? Whoops. I'm thinking about taking these. Because I like that. That's very, very. Look at that. That is that's gorgeous right there, man. That is gorgeous. I love that. I'm thinking about taking these up and putting these down instead. The standing lamp. I really like this side though. Like that side is just hella mischievous. The only problem is that I don't have a DIY for that yet. So I gotta like. That is not what I wanted to put down. Read what you're putting down, man. Yeah, this. See, I feel like this is going to look really cool. Look at that. Look at how good that looks. And then just imagine another one on the other side. It's going to look amazing. Wait a minute. Am I zoomed in? Oh, damn. I'm zoomed way in right now. I guess I am all the way zoomed out. I just feel like I'm really close to the camera. I need to push it back. I don't want to push it too far back though, because then you're going to see that metal piece. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool. So, yeah, man, I got to get that DIY, and we are going to go forward. But I was trying to see what was up with the Able Sisters, because I need to mess with this time, because it's starting to get too orange. And it's hard to decorate when everything is this orange. So, I got my piece of candy. I checked the DIYs. I think I'm going to skip forward. And then tomorrow... Cause this might be an episode. I actually might make this an episode because we did do a lot. We made those pumpkin patches great. I'm just saying. I mean, look at that. That is a beautiful pumpkin patch idea. And you got so much pumpkin. Like, and it don't require that much. You just need two apple trees, the paper and lanterns, the jack and lantern, the silo, 64 squares. <laughs> But I'm naming it off. It's like, yo, you need everything, yo. But you need 64 squares. You need the arch. You need the pumpkin patch sign. And that's it, really. I love it, though, man. It looks really good over here. So, yeah, what I think I'm going to do now is I'm going to skip forward. I haven't decided what I want to do here. See, I, I ran out of space. Because what I really wanted to do was I really wanted to put graffiti, not graffiti, but like, what would you call it? Like when they draw on the ground, I really would like to put something like that here. Even though that actually looks kind of cool. I mean, it doesn't really match the vibe. They really need to give us some more slots, man. I'm just saying. Like, I mean, I get it. They don't want to give us too much, but like, come on, man. With as much stuff with borders, like these borders take up way too many spaces. Either, listen, either give us more slots or let us be able to turn the design. Because if we could turn the design, we wouldn't need, you know, every single corner. You could just flip the corners the way you need them to be. So if they let us flip the designs, that would actually be cool too. 
or give us more spaces which i actually would recommend flipping the design because then you would only need one what like one design for each thing so like three max four max yeah you would need four so yeah i that's what i would recommend but because that's taking up the majority of this thing the only the actual only designs i have is like four or five right here and then the, the flag so yeah man but i do want to change this too because i want to make i don't want to take this up because i really like the way this looks it looks cluttered and i like that but at the same time i don't like that because it's it's kind of taken away from the whole look we got going and i'm thinking what i want to do i probably don't have enough spaces yeah i don't see i'm thinking about moving this pine tree and putting uh whatever this is called tree here but doing two of them kind of in a line with each other which is gonna interfere slightly with these bushes so it's gonna have to be like this is gonna come up to here you'll have maybe one bush in between maybe I could do a line of bushes in between them you know what it's only one way to find out and that's to just try it so let's try it if I don't like it I could always go back and, and dig it up that's part of the process you know you gotta be willing to take these chances if you wanna make your island great or amazing whichever word you want to choose all right now just plant this I really don't like planting roses because I don't think I'm gonna keep roses in the fall but there's a possibility and I just ruined that pattern but it's all good so let me eat a pumpkin real quick eat a pumpkin let me drop this right here I think that's where I want it, right? I think I'm going to... Actually, you know what? Let me eat two pumpkins. Because I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the hardwood tree, which is this tree, in the front. Right? And I'm going to put the cedar tree in the back. Of course it's okay just drop the candy bro always something with this guy <laughs> alright before I do that though I need to put down the pattern so I need to go into construction mode some sometimes I hate how long this takes but I guess the switch gotta change a lot of settings or something because why else would it take this long to switch alright now we need to go get the dirt and we need to put the dirt down. I don't know how this is going to look, y'all. So don't don't clown me if it looks stupid. Cuz I don't know. This is actually the first time I ever even thought about doing this. So I am going to have to pick this up and round these edges off. So I'm going to have to drop something. Well, I can put the tree down, can't you? Yeah, but then it's going to block my view. Facts, facts. Let's drop this. Pick this up. Then we're going to have to drop another dirt patch. And then we're going to have to smooth everything off. If you don't smooth it off, it ain't going to give you that vibe. I probably should put the pattern down too while the tree ain't there. And get an idea how it looks to make sure I even like this. I mean, I almost want to say I need. I wish they had a bush that was tall because I think it would look good here. 
But regardless, I'm going to go ahead and do this. This is going to take a hot little second. But I'm going to go ahead and do this ring around the rosy pattern. I'm going to commit to it, man. Because, you know, if you don't commit to it, you ain't going to never know if it works. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to commit to it. Alexa, set the house temperature to 72. Because it's getting hot in here, man. This, the, all these computers and TVs and lights. It raises the temperature of a room at least 5 to 10 degrees. And it might not sound like a lot, but that's the difference between 80 and 85. I mean, it's a big difference. So we're going to go ahead. We're almost done. Almost done. And then we're going to drop one here. By the way, man, make sure y'all go follow me on Instagram, bro. I've been stuck at 13,000, 13, for a minute. Actually, I lost some subscribers. I mean, some followers on Instagram, but I don't really post on there, so I don't blame nobody for it. Let me go ahead and put this cedar tree in here. And then go ahead and throw the hardwood tree here. How we feel about that? I actually think I like that. Now what I'm going to do in between and on the edges, I still don't know yet. Because that it does look kind of awkward. You know, I could have actually... I'm thinking. I'm actually thinking about moving this tree up one and then combining those two together and making one dirt patch instead of having a space in between the two. The only reason I'm kind of hesitant about that is because how are those TVs going to look then? I might could put the TVs on a. The whole point of the TVs, if y'all don't know, are to be like billboards. Now, whether or not they stay like that is <laughs> up in the air. But I don't know. I kind of like this, though. I need to change the time of day, and I need to time travel. So we're going to do that next episode. I love y'all. Peace. What did you do, Dan Dynasty? We in a new mansion, man. Look like he throwing. <laughs> time for that chrono. Why would you call the police? What is he doing? The energy he brings is so great. This is where the magic happens. Roll, roll over. <laughs> Damn. What did I see? Saw two BBCs. And that's a channel strike. <laughs> Come on now, y'all.